with members of the cross country team. They get set to head to the Big Ten Championships in East Lansing. And uh, if you guys just introduce yourself, please. Uh, I'm Donnie Royce. I'm a senior. Josh Sabo, redshirt freshman. Jackson Neff, redshirt sophomore. Nick Pepino, freshman. Blake Tanef, redshirt freshman. Can you guys uh, talk a little bit about what your expectations are heading into the Big Ten Championships this weekend? Yeah, so our goal for this weekend is to finish in the top half of the Big Ten, um, as well as just trying to be extremely competitive and just compete to our best. Yeah, I mean, we've run with teams like Illinois and Michigan State before. We uh, beat Michigan State with this exact same squad earlier on this year, so uh, we know we can, you know, run with, the, run with these guys and finish in the top half. And then, uh, can you guys talk a little bit about how these last few practices leading up to the Big Ten Championships have uh, sort of evolved for you guys as you prepare? Yeah, I mean, we started out early in the season doing a lot of steady state work, a lot of longer runs, um, just to build our strength, stuff like that. Um, and then lately we've been doing a lot of fart licks, a lot of 400s, just to uh, sharpen up and get our speed going a little bit. Obviously, as Jackson said, we've been cutting back quite a bit, trying to cut the volume, get a little bit faster to start preparing our body for the Big Ten race, start making us fresher. Um, we did a 400 workout to really work on stroke volume here this past week. And then we've been doing a lot of fart leg stuff. Um, a lot of it is designed around how the coach expects the race to go. Um, for example, we did a thing where we'd go hard for three minutes, a minute easy, then a little bit harder for two minutes. It's meant to simulate the sort of surges that would be typical in a Big Ten race. Midway through the race at two miles, three miles, you're already going hard. Then it picks up for a little bit at the excitement of the mile marker, and then we slow back down a little bit. So just things like that to help prepare our bodies and our minds. Uh, then uh, Donnie, last week, can you just kind of touch on Technically, the only upperclassman uh, left on this team with Chris Fallon going down to an injury. Um, can you talk a little bit about what it like, what it's like being on such a young team? Um, I mean, it's just a great opportunity to help build and uh, prepare this team for the future. Uh, there's a really highly talented group, and uh, they just need a little bit of direction. But uh, they'll be a good force later on this, later on in their career. So it's it's a great opportunity for me to help. Uh, be a leader and show them what show them what it's like to be competitive in the Big Ten Conference later on. All right, guys. Good luck this week. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you.